you get called up to do uh, some darks. You got yes. or a dark. You got a dark and Bobby Roode. You got a main event match against Gulak. Yeah. Um, just I I I heard you say that it was just kind of last minute. Like, hey, you're just gonna do this. Hey, yeah. you're gonna do that. Like, um, t- talk to me. Talk to me a little bit about uh, the SmackDown Dark situation and Vince and all yeah. That. It it was yeah literally the night before. So Thursday night, I get yeah. a call from. Uh, how did I just forget his name? John Cone. Yeah. Uh, and he's like, hey, we need you at SmackDown. And yeah. I was like, uh, what is it for? Like, just yeah. asking. And they're like, we're yeah. not too sure. Maybe a dark match. Yeah. Just bring your wrestling gear, be prepared. And also, Vince wants to meet you. Yeah. So I was like, okay, cool. Yeah. Um, so then I, I go to SmackDown, which was being filmed in Tampa at the time. So I yeah. just had to drive from Orlando to Tampa, yeah. which is easy enough. Yeah. Uh, get there meet all the people i'd yeah. already known a bunch of people you didn't have down. to set up the ring no which yeah. was nice yeah i got to be in the thunderdome for the first time yeah. which yeah. was interesting to interesting. see set up it's very yeah. very interesting setup yeah. um i was putting my match together with bobby Roode. yeah hurricane was our Produce. uh, producer yeah. really cool dude he was mm-hmm. helping us out and then i remember there's like a ring and backstage where you can work stuff out i was in there and then Lauren Artis was like, okay, time to meet Vince. And I was like, yeah. oh, okay. <laughs> Get out of the ring. Yeah. Go stand by his office for, our, I reckon, about 20 minutes just waiting. And then finally he, they open the door and yeah. Bruce and Johnny are behind me. And then I sit in a chair like this and literally where you are is where yeah. Vince is. And then we just speak for like 10, 15 minutes. It was nice. Yeah. Like spoke about wrestling, spoke about like where I came from, yeah. what he sees wrestling as, what he wants to do in the future. Yeah. What I need to change is an indie wrestler. Yeah. Which was Vince-isms that we had already heard. Of course. Keep your hands up. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he doesn't like bump and feeds anymore, even yeah. though Bloom made me do bump and feeds in all my matches. Of course. <laughs> of course, yeah. So, it's really just simple wrestling talk. Yeah. And then, yeah. shake his hand, go do my cool. dark match. Yeah. Cool. Seemed With very positive. The guys behind you. Yeah, that, like... was the, that was the most awkward thing, because yeah. they, like... That's just Vince, weird. Vince would say something to like, as in a joke, yeah. and then laugh and be like, ha, ha, and then they would go, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> like it felt too too much. I was like, come on, guys, like <laughs> the, the, his stooges now, I guess. Honestly, <laughs> honestly though, if they set up a couple cameras in that room, it would oh, be yeah. more entertaining than the television set up. <laughs> right, 100%. The, the real life. Yeah, dynamic well, well, you between. have. You know, wrestlers like myself, like sweating and meeting Vince McMahon, the yeah. god of wrestling or whatever yeah. he is, and then having these two guys there as well. Yeah. Like, it yeah. is very comical. It's, yeah. <laughs> it's, yeah. It's, it's, stra- it's just such a strange dynamic. Yeah. Don't give up. Don't give up. Fight forever. Don't give up. Fight forever. Don't give up. Fight forever! Fight forever! And ever! And ever! And ever!